we're, we're gonna do it. We're gonna do it. Just gotta make it, make it happen. This is not my favorite thing I've ever done. I don't care about the dust. It was the fear of being swallowed whole by a bunch of corn. This is what a good life does. We're off for the final, final cutting of hay. Yeah. and always take at least eight or ten things to get done to get one thing done. It's really awesome one-liners. Can you say what you just said? Good as snuff, near as dusty. Good as snuff, not near as dusty. Mm -hmm. Somebody write that down. Put it on t-shirt. Maybe I will. That's an old saying. Yep, they're ready to leave. <laughs> I thought you'd never come. <laughs> Hey mamas, about ready to have babies too, any day now. Well, hopefully a few more days. Our cows should start calving October 1st. Today is the what, 22nd? Won't be long. And I mean, as far as I'm concerned, they look pretty darn good. Hey, Mama. Is that what it is? Okay, come on, baby. It don't rain. It ain't no more. The poet and don't know it. I wish I had just recorded all that. I missed it. Can you say it again? Y'all better eat as you go and walk real slow. Not step on nothing with your old big toe. Because <laughs> if it don't rain, it ain't going to grow no more. And that's all of it. Oh, the first version was better, but I didn't get it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he was telling them they need to just stop and eat where they were at because it's not getting any better. We're so dry. What are we looking Dad's been rubbing on it, but it's a fox or groundhog or something in that hole right there. I've been rubbing up something going in out there. Nice to have gate help today. Good gate help. <laughs> Thank you, buddy. So my son just showed me something that is slightly disturbing. <laughs> oh my God. 
gosh. Okay, stop. I'll be coughing. <clears throat> okay, maybe it's time to vacuum the truck. Is that something you want to do for mm -mm. me? <laughs> oh, well, it's just a little dirt. A little dirt never hurt. I really wish I had a traffic walk right now. Hey. I love this stuff. See, when I see chocolate milk in the grocery store, I don't just see milk. I don't just see chocolate milk. I don't just see strawberry milk. It's what kind, whatever kind of milk it is. I love it. So when I see when I see milk in the um grocery store, I don't just see milk. I see the best liquid ever made or yeah, kind of um thank you cows got a new helper who's taking over my job she wants to she wants to get them all <laughs> so she really wants to help so she's gonna bring them to the truck I'm gonna load them in here. We have a we have a little process now. She wants to get them all by herself, so that's awesome. Yep, the little muscles are just gonna get bigger and bigger. She's getting the gates too. Mm. We got us a good worker here, Bonnie. You're excited about it too, aren't you? Hmm. I got kicked out. <laughs> breakfast. It's breakfast time. It almost feels like fall this morning. Yay! some scrub. Grass is about dried up. Hey kids, that, that looks great little man. Wooly, you're already starting to get your winter coat. Holy smokes. <laughs> These are little woolly mammoths. Aren't you buddy? Yes I is. Yes I is. Sweating. I've been sweating hot in your baby. This little man. This is Lawrence's horse that has done a little of everything. Roping, trail riding, I don't know. Pickup horse, bull riding. He's been a good one. Oh my gosh, but he's so <laughs> hot. You need to tell your body not to grow your winter hair so, sh so soon. It would make it easier on you, buddy. So I bought Penny when I was, uh, I don't know, a junior or senior in college. I'd never owned a horse, but I had been around him a little bit. And um, she's a breeding stock paint. So that means I was able to get her at a price I could afford. <laughs> and um, she's never done anything special. Just trail ride. We, sh we tried a little open shows, Western Pleasure, a little bit when I first got her. Just played around, but. And now she's just a pasture ornament. We used to ride, we used to ride. Lawrence and I rode a lot before the kids were born, before they came along. We used to trail ride a lot here on the farm and we would go to the mountains and ride, but um, all that just kind of stopped. And we really need to get back into riding. Lawrence used to ride a horse every single day. He used to do all of the checking of cattle by horse. And then we pulled, we started pulling the cows up into smaller lots and we started using the four wheeler and then a gator and this year it'll be the mule. So anyway, we gotta get back to riding though. There's a little girl 
It's a little girl that really wants to ride, don't you? Yep. <laughs> we're we're gonna do it. We're gonna do it. Just gotta make it make it happen. So I lied, y'all. I thought we were done with hay, but he found a little more that could be cut and we need all we can get. So some junk to grass it is. But look y'all. So we're gonna do this tomorrow. He's freezing. Gonna get a rag. So he's um he's greasing it. But my feelings are really hurt. Last time I used this was in the bean field. Remember it was dark and dusty. And yeah. Um look what I did, y'all. I don't even know how I did it. It hurts my heart, y'all. I hurt my leg. I didn't mean to. I didn't mean to, Rita. I didn't mean to hurt you. Uh, and he had to replace, uh, I'm gonna say this one. Yep. Had to replace a tooth. Not what you call them, a tooth? Something like that. Uh, darn. I don't know what I got into. Yeah, hurts my heart right there. Hurts my heart. You know, probably on the stick where it looked, but the tooth was bent out of the rubber. Oh, well. Need to get some paint. Everyone says I should get you a grease gun for Christmas. I want one of those like you. I know, that's what I told him. He doesn't want one. He likes this. He says if he did that, then he would get lazy. Is that what you said? Okay. <laughs> then the battery goes dead. Oh, there's something else to have to fix. You don't have to... You can't tell how much grease you're putting in a universal joint and blow the seal. Oh. Alright. Mm. Okay, well... Then you won't be getting that for Christmas. I don't know what else you could use. Hmm. <laughs> Maybe some clothes. so dry um, I think we got some spit last night just a little spit but not enough to help anything it's <sighs> trying to call him in man y'all it's hot out here it sure does not feel like September 30th let me tell you that 
Where is fall? Where is fall, y'all? hard set on climbing up there and I told him not to. <laughs> I was going to get up there and get a sample. So this is our bin. This is going to be our bin. Well, it is our bin. We just need to move it. You see that? But we got to feed, get all the corn out of it first. It's exciting. I'm excited. We have a bin, y'all. A big bin. This is not my favorite thing I've ever done. So that was not fun. Honestly, that was not fun. It made me a little nervous. Okay. We got all this to where it was right here. That's all we needed. Just needed a little bit. Oh well. I went all the way up there for a reason. I think you can change it. Just take it. Well, I just said it's obvious to see who's who's doing the work here, right? I get an extra special thank you. Thank you. A baby. Hardy's dinner. <laughs> and a heart. I'm, I'm gonna buy you supper, baby. <laughs> <laughs> you done good. Thank now, you. You're gonna have to listen to all that chin music <laughs> going down in there. I you did. Be a dusty, man. I did that. play a little chin music. It was a little. It was a little out of my comfort zone. I don't care about the dust. It was the fear of being swallowed whole by a bunch of corn. But I wasn't, so it's okay. Put over here with the hole in it mm -hmm. and bring the auger, because the auger comes from the center. Unbolt it oh, turn that around. and break it and, and oh. bring it over there. Yeah, okay. we, we'd like to have it, something like that. This end of the slab. Mm -hmm. This is the barn shed over there. Mm -hmm. In the road right here, it's kind of flat right there. Mm -hmm. You can back up and dump and all get in there. There's power lines coming over there, but I think we can get under. Hmm. Don't we have to load from over here? And then you can unload anywhere because you're all going to be coming out that way, you know. Mm -hmm. I think you put another hole in there and put the oil in there. Well, yeah, I think you can take that piece of tin and just, just move the whole bottom around. The one with a hole in it. It ain't nothing but a hole. I mean, you can patch that and put another hole somewhere. <laughs> you ready to go, Bonnie? You ready to go feed? <laughs>
girls. Per usual, he's up there waiting on me. <sighs> Trying to fix the lunches and get the radio and not forget all the things. All right, we're off for the final, final cutting of hay. I mean, raking. Raking and rolling. Perfect day to wear this. There's still some of these t-shirts available and tanks just gonna put that little plug out there everything else well a lot of things have sold out hat sold out orange and black sold out but they'll be back next week so if you didn't get one you'll have your chance <laughs> subscribe on my page and, and stay tuned all right here we go ready Freddie Actually, this tractor, oh, hit my butt. Um, this tractor doesn't have a name. Nope. So that's sad. All right. All right, I'm gonna start it without pushing the clutch in. Here we go. Let's find some air.
over here and work our way up the river instead of down the river. That's what I've been told anyway. I don't see him though. I know that's what he's saying. Engage the rake 
and back up and pick up a little bit here on the edge. Perfect timing, here it comes. Yep. Alright, it's all the way 
out. today anyway <laughs> and that sad sad sound <laughs> that's oddly satisfying <laughs> hey girls <laughs> he just dropped off this little piece this little piece of nothing and they're like give it to me I want that oh I'm gonna run because I don't know what that is on two legs I know, you've never seen me before, have you? I need to roll it under there. Maybe we can do that together. Y'all about ready to have a baby any day now? How you feeling about that? They're literally cooking. It's 95 degrees. They're literally cooking in there. So, maybe that'll help pop them out sooner. 